Alright, welcome back everybody to episode 2 of Let's Drink to Borderlands 2. Uh, this is the, the screenshot that Tim was talking about. It might be in the first uh, the first episode overlaid too, but this is hilarious. So we're going to go back to the game here. And uh, pick up where we left off. I have just murdered... We have just murdered... An entire village worth of... Uh, Psychos and mercenaries. You know, if you want to grab multiple things in a box, you can just hold down F. Yeah. I'd been doing that for some reason. I just kind of double tapped on that one. Ah. I felt like I was committed to the action. Hey, Did you just birdie. shoot something out of the sky? Yep. <laughs> I like how we're getting experience points for that. Well, because they're, they're racks. I say! Chip chip! Cheerio! Yay, I like how I can see... Rifle. I think I can see your HUD. To, to a degree. Like, projected in front of your face. <laughs> it's kind of cool. Alright. So oh, we're supposed to go this way. Find more audio logs. Uh, the audio logs are all back in here. Wait for me! I can't do this without you! <laughs> so yeah, we have the, uh, the hammerlock drink, and I was working on, um, on a handsome jack drink, because... The handsome Jack needs a drink. He's he's cool enough. But uh I got about as far as buying a bottle of Yukon Jack and then um drinking half of it. It it did not feel handsome. <laughs> Audio log. What the hell are you? Why do you retreat? Face your end honorably. Make me work for it. Who sent you? His sister? His kids? Whatever they're offering, I'll quintuple it. This is punishment. His is that you? Will be avenged, and I will be paid. Yep. For God's sake, what do you want? Just tell me you what you want. You are an evil bastard. Some ice cream. There were bats in the garbage container. And another audio log. I got a gun. Hey, everybody! How are you? Jack here! Nobody knows! What is the meaning of this? Wilhelm. Oh, sorry, what was your name? Pierce. Well, Miss Pierce, and please don't tell me it's Mrs. Pierce to break my heart. This train doesn't belong to you, so why don't you turn around and face me, pumpkin? This what? train was commandeered later. Sir under Wilhelm. The Holy of boss. stabbing tongue. What happened to your freaking face? I don't love his last oh. attack. You're so witty, Jack. We are playing King of the Hill, right? <laughs> well, if we are, then you won since you got to the hill faster than I did. I'm a winner! Winner, winner, chicken dinner! Where the hell's the other fucking audio log? It's on the map. It's over here by Hammerlock's house. He just loves listening to the voice of 
Helen appears. He's got a freaking gun vending machine in his backyard. <laughs> I want a gun vending machine in my backyard. Except one that's not filled with shitty pistols. <laughs> No, no, that's not the ideologue. That's just money. Yay! Okay, how about this? Lady, I don't even know what to call you. You tell me why you look like you headbutted a belt sander, and I'll let all of you go right now. My husband gave me a skag pearl ring. The pearl released hunger-inducing pheromones. Oh, you know what? I am so sorry. I, I just forgive me. What, where's your husband now? He's dead. You know what Jack reminds me of? Have you ever seen um, Repo: The Genetic Opera? I have not. It's really good. You should see it. Um, it's uh, a rock opera. Directed by Darren oh. Bozeman. Ah, interesting. About um, this corporation in the future that uh, has sold people oh, super genetic Your upgraded organs. Like... <laughs> oh my God, and uh, they have hired oh, a repo man. For when uh, the people don't pay their bills. Mm -hmm. Jack killed her, did he? Shame. A shame. And uh, the Repo Man is, is of Please course, played by you are capable of doing so. Anthony Head <laughs> from from Buffy, who is uh, actually really good. It's basically the same plot as Repo Man with Jude Law. Mm -hmm. um, came out around the same time too. My choices are fresh aim shot, and angry TMP. I'm gonna pick an, an angry, angry TMP. Gun. I'm gonna pick an angry gun. Inflict my rage on others. Oh, over here. It's Here's over the, across the bridge. Here's the quick change hey, machine you that can change your the way you walk. Station. You can oh, use cool. this to change your appearance and reset your skin Maybe it's points. possible for you to pick a skin that doesn't make you a short midget. What if I like being a short midget? That's true. Changing your skin color... Strange, the only things you can change are your head or your skin color, and I'm wondering how the heck you're a midget. It's almost like you're like a percentage of your size reduced. It's like you're down downscaled to midget size. Am I still a midget? Yep, still a midget. Sweet. <laughs> it's just why? Why are you a midget? I gotta be like a badass midget though, because I can keep up with you. That is true. You can run my little piggy midget legs off. And you keep up with a ninja. But yeah, uh, yeah, it's basically the same plot as that, and um, there's this one character in it who's uh, one of the sons of the guy who owns the Oregon Corporation, mm -hmm. and he's, like, beauty-obsessed, so he swaps faces to the point where his face always just looks like this mask that's been, like, clipped on in the corners. Interesting. And, uh... Every time I see Handsome Jack pop up, he kind of looks like that. Because he's got the clips on the side. Yeah. I don't know if his face is actually clipped on, but... This looks like a fun place. Skulls hanging from fly poles. It's like my apartment. <laughs> Ow. I'm gonna die. Ow. 
second win, third win, fourth win. Whatevers. I'm made of wind. Dang it. I was killing him. Oops, sorry. I actually had to take a second to. I actually had to take a second to stop what I was doing and look behind me because the flag shadow was moving behind me, and I wasn't quite sure if that was a flag or you were trying to mount me from behind. <laughs> I'm trying to save you. It's an interesting way of saving me. I just keep getting knocked the hell down. What the fuck? I'll just keep reviving you. <laughs> That worked. Ow. Of course, the moment I come up out of the ground... Are you kidding me? I need a shield. I think that's my problem. I don't have a shield. How do you have a shield? Uh, I think I got it as a quest reward from Hammerlock. You can't have it. Hmm. Check my inventory. Nope, I don't have one. Probably sold it by accident. I'll just find one off of one of these dead bandits at some point. Clearly, this means Hammerlock likes me better. Yes. He gave you the better one. And I don't even know what mine looked like, but I know yours is better. I, I should probably clarify. The diamond horse I've been telling you about, it's not a sculpture or anything. It's a living horse that actually happens to be made of... Oh boy. Actually, I'll just... I'll go get her. What's that? Hey girl! What's that? Say hello! Yeah. <laughs> Butt Stallion says hello. Butt Stallion. Money. Money, 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 money! money. Light the fuses, bitches! He's so fucking green. Oh, look, another midget. Maybe we can bond over our midgetness. Oh, goodness. Ah, uh, crap. I am down. No more wins for me. Oh, God, I'm down, too. Wow. That was... God, I really am a midget. <laughs> I told you! You are totally pint-sized death dealer. Alright. Aw, oh, man, that one cost $41. I'm gonna go buy a shield. Do I have one? I think I have one, yeah. I don't, wanna, I don't wanna keep dying. I I don't wanna die. I don't even have my class skill yet. I am so underdeveloped. Steve the lion. Oh, there's another word. All right, I got a shield. That conveniently has more health than my regular health. I have Not over bad. double the amount of health now. All right, I think there's something up here. I'm back. A ding dang do. How do I get up here? You can't. It's just there for aesthetics. No, no come, come over here. I bet if, um... Well, you want to jump I on top if, of my head? Yeah, yeah. I bet if one of us were standing on the other shoulders, we could get up there. You can try it. Maybe you could, like, jump on top of my head and do a Mario move and, like, double jump. 
Cue the Mario music. Alright, uh, I'm closer. Why don't you try getting in there? Alright. You just gotta keep moving and make it hard. I was trying to like wedge myself into the car. Uh, I can't Can you get up there. I can't jump when I'm on top of your head. I just bounce. Ah. Uh. Oh well. I bet this is some really good stuff. I'm gonna look on YouTube as soon as I put this up, and it's like how to get in that cave in the beginning. Rocket backpack powered midgets. I like how Claptrap's just shaking in the corner. I'm just gonna concentrate on the laser. Fuck this day up. Stop moving, Boom Boom. I wanna kill you. Hold still. Don't run. Don't run. Ow. Throwing grenades at me. Critical. Oh, yeah. Ow. Of course, now they spawn little guys. That would have been easy for us to get our second wave with. Yeah! Second winded. Little midget. All right, how do I use grenades? I'm not sure how to get up here, and it seems that grenades would be useful. I'm just sniping okay. the driver. There we go. Okay. Or maybe I could just shoot the gun. Yeah, I just sniped him. Oh, he came out of the machine? I thought I was going to kill him. Great. Never ending wave of psychos. I love this gun. What gun is it? Little pistol? I am in this location! <sighs> yeah, it's um inflammatory animosity. <clears throat> and it is for lighting bitches on fire. Awesome. No, we're not. 
You just so happen to be going the same way we're going, bitch. I have this weird, um, icon in my corner above my health bar. It just yep. says one. Yay, we have, yeah, we finally have skills. So, you can press tab or I or something and bring up your, uh, menu. And then you can go to the one that looks like a crosshair and you can spend your skill points. First one has to be your class skill. All the ones after that are, uh, whatever the heck you want. Finally! Go stealth. Mess up their day. Oh, oh god. That, that was. Oof. Stay still. And I tried to res you and I died. I'm trying to get my second wind. Holy crap! Someone someone got in the freaking turret. Why'd you get out of that thing? I wasn't aware that that next bit was gonna happen. <laughs> Great, now we got yeah. birds too. The the bit where we uh got our asses handed to us. At least they're keeping their fire on the birds. It's still over there. Yep. I kind of figured he was a little bit higher priority. Stop preparing, you're always preparing, just do it. Alright, get back in the gun. The action key. Uh, yeah, the action key isn't showing up. Ah, oh, crap. Catch up to Claptrap. I think uh, I think we should call the episode once we get to Claptrap. Yeah. All right. So, uh, I might have tried to stage a mutiny on Captain Flint's ship before the flash freeze, which explains why his men are currently beating the crap out of me. Right, guys? Shut up. Okay. <laughs> okay. I want a giant fire breathing dragon ship. Except not one that's stuck on an iceberg.
like how holy hell these... that's a fish story wow you really did catch a fish that big I like how it has X's for eyes too all right, we've got a good lull here, so I think uh, we're going to call it for this week. Thanks, uh, thanks everyone, for joining us on Let's Drink to Borderlands 2. Cheers, Internet. Cheers. <laughs>